Hey, Jim Parr here, and a lot of people come to me because we develop a lot of websites, we teach blogging, and uh, they set up an AdSense account, and they get this risk error, earning risk error, ads.txt file. So I'm going to walk through some quick steps in WordPress on how to fix this. So when you see it, you're in your... Uh, probably in your home dashboard, but go to sites. Um, you're going to see this error message here. And the first thing that you want to do is download this TXT file. And it, it's just a file that um, we're going to add into WordPress. So we're going to go ahead and download that. We're going to open this file and just do a quick show you what it looks like um, as we open this up. So get this open and um, here's the way the file looks. So it's got a uh, publisher number and uh, if you want to put that number in, I'll, I'll take your uh, revenues for you any day. So the next thing that we're going to do, we're going to go into our WordPress dashboard and we're going to add a new plugin over on the left here. And then uh, if you need to pause and do this, that's fine. Uh, the plugin that we're going to add is a free plugin called File Manager. And this, you know, you can do this in cPanel the same way. Um, but this just allows you to quickly install it uh, using a, putting a file manager in the back end of WordPress. So the system is the same if you were using a different uh, website and you needed to log into the cPanel because basically what you're doing, you're adding a cPanel to your WordPress by doing this. So we installed and activated that plugin and now we're gonna go in to uh, find that plugin, which is right down here on the left, and we're gonna open it. And basically it's gonna look at our files and look in the back end of the website and it's gonna tell us exactly what's in there. So I'm just going to say no thanks on this, but this is the way the root directory, and of course it says to add it into the root level domain of each site. So um, this is the way the cPanel would look in, a, in an essence. It'd be under public HTML, uh, or you can do this in the back end of your file manager. So the next step that we're going to do is we're going to create an ads.txt file. So that is one of these right here. So it's a new file, not a new folder. And uh, it's going to be a plain text, uh, plain text file. So it's going to be called ads.txt. So we're going to just save that. And... Um, and then what we're going to do from here is we're just going to get rid of this right here. But we can go and do a code editor on this and actually right here. And we're just going to input that code that we saw on that uh, on this from AdSense itself. So we're going to copy and paste that into here. And then we're going to save and close it. One thing to remember once you add that file in, it may take a couple of days for those to activate. So it does say it may take a few days to change and update. So just check back and watch for the, this uh, error to go away. So just remember that it's not automatic. So once it's in there to test it, this is shitsuparadise.com, which is a blog that we have. Uh, we're just going to do ads.txt, and there it is. There's the file there. Now, there's one other step that you want to do in this, just to clear things up. I don't like having a file manager on the back end of my uh, WordPress site because it gives access to... Uh, people that you probably don't want to give access to. So the next step that we're going to do is uh, we're going to go in here and we're going to go back into plugins and we're going to find that plugin. We're going to deactivate it 
and it was called File Manager. So let's find it real quick right here. Deactivate WP File Manager. And then we're just going to delete it. Now let me just show you one other thing that even though we deleted it, we can refresh this file, adds.txt, and we still have it there. So if you have any questions, leave your comments below. Um, I, I always answer questions. Uh, if you're looking to do a blog that's profitable, our Shih Tzu Paradise blog is just skyrocketing off the charts. It's money that we don't, you know, we did the work and we built it. And uh, But I have an incredible blog academy uh, at jimpar.com. That's J-I-M-P-A-A-R.com. And uh, it's very reasonable and uh, you can get going. But uh, I'd love to answer any questions. Remember, hit that notification bell and hit that subscribe button. And uh, we do a lot of videos to help you out on your websites constantly. So thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.